A cricket team has 11 players and each of them has played 20 matches till date. Virat, Rohit, Mahindra, Rahul and Shikhar have scored runs at an average of 60, 55, 50, 45 and 40 respectively. The rest of the players have scored at an average of 25 each. In the next 10 matches, Virat and Rohit each scored 900 runs. Whereas Mahindra scored twice as that, that of Rahul. After 30 matches, if Virat's new average score is twice that of Rahul, what is the approximate average score of Mahindra? And to, to start with, Rohit, and Shikhar and others are all useless. Yeah, they might be playing a role for the team. They're useless as far as this question is concerned. And so what is linked here? Virat's average, new average is twice that of Rahul. And Mahendra scored twice that of Rahul in these 10 matches, the next 10 matches. And I'm going to worry about the average for Virat to start with. Virat had at the end of 20 matches an average of 60. So Virat total runs equals 20 into 60 plus 900. This is the first 20 matches and the last 10 matches. 20, 60, 1200, 1200 plus 900 is 2100. Virat average is 2100 by 30 total matches. This is 70. At the end of 30 matches, Virat's new average is twice that of Rahul. Or Rahul average is 35. New average at the end of 30 matches. Or Rahul total. 35 into 30 which is 1050 now Rahul is 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 Rahul has an original average of 45 for 20 matches his new average is 35 after 30 matches and so Rahul at the end of 20 matches has scored a total of 45 into 20 Rahul at the end of 30 matches has scored a total of 1050. 45 into 20 is 900. This is 1050. Or last 10 matches, Rahul has scored 150 runs. Super, we've got that. Now, what do we have? We bring Mahendra into the picture. Mahendra scored twice that of Rahul in those 10 matches. In those 10 matches, Rahul has scored 150. So, Mahendra. In the 10 matches has scored 300. Mahindra in the first 20 matches, how much has he scored? Third number, so 60, 55 and 50. First he scored 50 average in 20 matches. So in the first 20 matches he scores 1000. In the last 10 he scores 300. What will be his average? 1300 divided by 30. 130 by 3, 120 by 3 is 40, 43.33 is closest to 43. Done. Very routine question, but it's complicated because there's a lot of data given. Rohit, Shikhar, other players, we don't care about. We get Virat's total, we get Virat's average. We know Rahul's average, we can find Rahul's total. We know Rahul's total for 30 matches, we can find Rahul what he scored in the last 10. We know what Rahul scored in the last 10, we can find what Mahindra scored in the last 10. We get what Mahindra scored in the last 10, we can find what Mahindra told overall 30 and then we can find the average 43.33.